Let's balance the equation C8, H17OH plus O2, and that's going to give us CO2 plus H2O. This is a combustion reaction. We have a hydrocarbon, we have oxygen gas, and we get carbon dioxide and water. So it's combustion, specifically organic combustion. Let's count the atoms up, and then we'll balance the equation. So let's leave the hydrogens and oxygens until last. Let's start with carbon. So we have eight here, just one here. We'll put an eight as our coefficient in front of the CO2. One times eight, that's eight. So those are balanced, and we need to update the oxygen atoms. Eight times two is 16, plus that one here with the water, that gives us 17. Let's do the hydrogens. If I put a nine as my coefficient in front of water, two times nine, that'll give me 18. That balances the hydrogens, but we need to update the oxygens again. 8 times 2 is 16, plus 9 times the 1. That gives us 25 oxygen atoms. So this is kind of a bit of a challenge. Here's the way you can think about this, though. We have our 1 oxygen here, plus some number of oxygens. That'll equal 25. So we need 24 more oxygen atoms. And that's pretty easy, because we can just put a 12 here. So the 12 times 2, that gives us the 24, the 1 plus the 24, that gives us 25. We're done. This equation is balanced. So that's it. This is Dr. B with the balanced equation for C8817OH plus O2. Thanks for watching.